Ellie Kirsten getting ready to head to Minnesota this weekend for the triple duels. Uh, going back to the IU meet on Saturday, both of you had career best times, Allie in the 200, Kirsten in the 1,000. You don't usually think of late January as a time that career bests come up like that. Did you feed off the kind of energy in the pool with the Indiana duel at the rivalry? Uh, yeah, I think there was like a lot of adrenaline going into the meet. Everyone was super pumped. This is a meet that everyone gets really excited for, like even two weeks before. And we've just come down from winter training, so we've been working really, really hard. And I feel like all of that coming together just created a really good meet. And Kirsten, you had just seen your teammates win the 200 medley relay, and it kind of transferred over to you a little bit? Oh, yeah, definitely. I mean, I I saw after we won that, like I just got like, an adrenaline rush through me a little bit, so I probably went out a little faster in that race than I should have, but you know, it ended up to uh, work out in the end for me. And it was a lot of fun. How would you describe the camaraderie, or how different is the camaraderie among the distance group than maybe the rest, other parts of the team? Well, I would say, I mean, we definitely have uh, really hard practices, yeah. and uh, so, I mean, but we just do it. We kind of just, like, we don't complain about it. We just go and swim fast and race each other, and I think, like, that, you know, it's uh, creating a strong like bond between minutes. us. Get ready. And, Let's go. I don't know. We just do it, and I think we have a good positive energy going, and it's a lot of fun. Allie, what's your favorite part about being part of the distance crew? Uh, I like being a part of the distance group because I feel like we're all just, I mean, not that we seclude ourselves from the rest of the team, but with the type of people, all of us, we know it needs to get done. We go in, we do it, and the harder Kirsten pushes herself, I push myself. The harder Nika pushes herself, I do. So it's all kind of like, we're very competitive with each other, but we're all best friends, so it works. And this will be, I think, fourth year in a row that the women have gone to Minnesota for one meet or another. Big Tens and NCAAs have been there the last couple years for you, Allie. Is it a, a pool you feel pretty comfortable in? Yeah, I think Minnesota definitely feels like a second home for how many times I've been there. Um, I'm obviously not from the Midwest, but for how many times we've had meets there, I feel so comfortable. I know it's a fast pool. I know we can get things done there, so it's very exciting. And Kirsten, even though you're a freshman, being from Wisconsin, you have been to uh, the pool of Minnesota before. Tell yeah. us about that. Um, well, I was there my sophomore year for the Grand Prix meet, and it wasn't really a big deal for me or anything. We just went for one day after our high school state meet, but it'll be fun to go, you know, get some nice, uh, cold Minnesota weather, oh kind of like Wisconsin, oh. so, um, yeah, I know I'm excited to, you know, go back and, you, you know, race somewhere else new, so, yeah. And is there kind of a feeling that light at the end of the tunnel that come Monday, you know, you start the preparations for Big Ten in earnest and uh, kind of the best time of the year to be a swimmer? Uh, yeah, I would say so. I mean, pretty much November through January is just training like nobody's business. We get in there, yards, 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 full blown, and then here comes the quad meet, or I guess we're only having two other, and it's like, oh my gosh, when this is over, everything's gonna finally get, start getting a little bit easier, and more exciting too, obviously, because Big Tens. Kirsten, what are you thinking about the first uh, kind of taper here at Purdue leading into Big Tens? Well, um, I'm really excited to taper. This is the longest I've ever gone without tapering, so I'm like really thirsty for it. Thirsty? But, yeah. But, um, no, I'm really excited, you know, like I'm, I'm pretty nervous like for Big Tens just because it's something I've never experienced, but I'm also really pumped up because I know that I've worked harder, like as hard as I ever have before, and I've done things in practice I've never done before, so I'm really excited to see what's in store for me at Big Tens. So. Good luck this weekend. Thanks.